Well, welcome back. Hope you are doing great. Well, I have taken a billboard in my Photoshop and I want to put an image here. So how to do that? And it's very easy. First, I have to go to the file and then open or you can press Ctrl O in the keyboard. After that, go back and take an image which you want to place here. I need a landscape image and this is the portrait and it will create problem while increasing the size. Well, I'm taking this one. It will take a little bit time to open in Photoshop because this is a high quality image. Well, I have got that. Now, there are two documents. One is my billboard here in the left side and another is the image which I want to place there. Well, this is a beautiful image. Three friends, they have um, gathered in one place and taking selfie. I want to place that in the billboard. Well, first what I have to do, I have to select the white portion with the selection tool. I can take any quick selection tool, magic wand tool. First, I'll try with the magic wand tool because I don't want to spend too much time here. So I'll take that and left click here in the middle so within a second it will select the area but it has selected the road also so the problem is that i have to press ctrl d for this selection and here i have to put the tolerance zero because it is very white and i'll select that if i put zero then it gets like that well if i press five now too much and if I take three, no, two, no, I can't do the selection with the magic one tool. So I have to change that. What I can take? Quick selection tool. So I'll start selection from here. Yes, I have got that. So each and every time in a white, in a white background, magic one tool will not apply because there are lots of white persons here in the cloud, road, and in the billboard. Well, that time you have to carry another way. That means another selection tool. No problem. You could take the pen tool also. And then I have selected this billboard, that means this area. And now I have to go to my main image here. And I'll press Control A. Control A for selecting the whole image. Then Control C. Control C. You can press two or three times, no problem. And then go to that image here. And we knew that if i select any area in any object that means each and every changes will happen in that area only so if i do anything here then it will happen only inside the selection well and now i will press Control alter shift v Well, it's, it's taking a little bit time and the image has been placed inside the billboard. And now I have to press Ctrl T for transform selection. And I have got that, but this is very big. I'll press Ctrl minus to zoom out. Watch here, the image, very big image. So 
I'll decrease the size here and then I'll press Ctrl 0 for fit to the screen and then I'll decrease the size of the image yes that's perfect and I'll take it a little bit down so that we can see that they are taking selfie mm, I'm taking a little bit small size yes I have to increase it a little bit yes or is increase and decrease from the corner and make sure this is on if you don't create it on then it will not increase and decrease equally from all side well yes and now press enter or click on the tick mark now you are done you have placed the image inside the billboard and now if you want you can take the text tool and if you want you can write down here the text size is so big I'm decreasing the size this is also too much Make your moment beautiful and I'll change the text style. Lato is perfect here and I'll put it bold and let's check out. Yes, make your moment beautiful. I'll select all and decrease it more. 12. And I'll press the backspace button, press enter. It has taken a very big gap. I'll press Ctrl A and Ctrl T. If you get like this, then you have to watch here. Take the text tool and press Ctrl T and you will get it here. This is the text size and you have to put here the same size 12. Now we'll get it near of your text. So this is the correct combination. If you take the size 12 and the gap will be 12 make your moment beautiful and i'm making it more thick well regular and this one i want as bold medium or put it bold well and now place your text here make your moment beautiful well and i will change the text color i have to change the text color mm, i'll take the eyedropper to let's take green and how it looks No, green is not highlighting. If I take the eyedropper tool, take this color pink. Pink will not highlight. I'm taking black. Not fully black. Well, no problem control minus yes this is the actual size of the billboard now it's looking great well and now what you have to do you have to go to the file and save as 
if you want you can save it as PSD so that you can edit it later sometimes we need to edit the file and save on your computer okay and I'll select my folder where I am to save that I have to create a date so that I can find my work very easily so always decorate your work go to there and try to save each and every time as a PSD file. Billboard. And I'm saving it as Photoshop. And okay. And you can see the progress here, saving 0%. Don't do anything until it finishes. Saving 99%. Now you can go to the file, export, export as um, sorry, not export. I can uh, save it uh, uh, as um, PNG in the save as, but if you export it. I'm showing you if you export it in Photoshop then you will get the high resolution file it's taking a little bit time well and I have got my export window and I'll select here export and then I'll go to my folder and I am on my folder I'll save apps Hope you have understood and best of luck for you. Thank you so much.